News 8 at 5 starts now. We start with IT Maid and the fight to stop the spread of flu around Indiana. 11 Hoosiers have died from the flu and doctors warn this could be a long winter. IT Maid's Richard Essex has the warning from area hospitals. Effective immediately, all of the major Indianapolis hospitals are restricting access to their facilities. You must be related to the patient over the age of 18 and not showing any signs of COVID or flu-like symptoms. It's the latest attempt to curb a potentially deadly flu season. IU Health, the state's largest hospital chain, announced today they are restricting access to 10 central Indiana locations, including their flagship operation, Methodist Hospital and Riley Hospital for Children. In a statement sent to IT Maid, only two members of the patient's immediate family, 18 or older, are allowed in the patient's room. And the hospital is requiring everyone must wear a mask. Visitors with flu-like or COVID symptoms, fever, cough, or chills are not permitted to visit. The emergency room at Franciscan Hospital on the south side of Indianapolis is reporting the highest rate of influenza-like illness patients in a decade. Usually flu season peaks in February, March. Um, this year, we're already seeing a, a very uh, early peak. Uh, and again, it's likely due to both flu and COVID uh, sort of overlapping here uh, in uh, early December, late late November. Um, but it, we're, we're uh, definitely uh, running much higher than we have in years and the highest we have in uh, 10 years. In the age group filling up Franciscan's emergency department is 5 to 17-year-olds. They tend to get the flu and other influenza-type illnesses at a higher rate and consequently spread it around. But it's also leading to a you know, significant number of flu patients being hospitalized. We're definitely seeing an uptick in uh, COVID patients being hospitalized uh, as well. Typically, the younger patients are not hospitalized, but they do put a strain on resources. Seven weeks ago, Indiana was listed as low risk by the CDC. As of the first week in December, Indiana is listed as red hot. Community Health Network, Franciscan Health Indianapolis, Ascension St. Vincent's, Indiana University Health, and Eskenazi all participate in the Indianapolis Coalition for Patient Safety. This coalition was organized in 2003 to share best practices and information. The Marion County Health Department is asking all participating hospitals to restrict visitors to the Tier 1 visitor policy effective immediately. The bottom line, if you are not related to the patient under the age of 18, or have flu-like symptoms, steer clear of the hospitals. These restrictions are likely to stay in place until the end of the flu season, which is next spring. In Indianapolis, Richard Essex, Wish TV, IT Maid.